powerful eruption, and Yellowstone sends visitors running for their lives. A sudden hydrothermal eruption rocked Yellowstone National Park on Tuesday morning, sending visitors running for safety. The incident occurred in Biscuit Basin, a geothermal area known for its hot springs and other thermal features. Park officials closed the Biscuit Basin area following the explosion, which sent steam, water and debris hundreds of feet into the air. The incident serves as a stark reminder of the dynamic and unpredictable nature of Yellowstone's geothermal landscape. While such eruptions are common in the park, their sudden and dramatic nature can take visitors by surprise. Yellowstone is home to the world's largest concentration of geysers and hot springs, making it a unique and exciting destination for both tourists and scientists. Yellowstone National Park's geothermal areas are continuously monitored by scientists to track changes and potential hazards. This latest incident highlights the importance of visitor awareness and adherence to safety guidelines in this ever-changing environment. While the investigation into the explosion continues, park officials are working to ensure the safety of visitors and the fragile ecosystem that makes Yellowstone such an extraordinary place. Yellowstone National Park experienced a significant hydrothermal eruption on the 23rd of July 2024. The eruption occurred in Biscuit Basin, a popular area known for its geothermal features. Hydrothermal eruptions occur due to sudden pressure changes in the underground water system. These eruptions can eject hot water, steam, and rock fragments into the air. These eruptions are relatively common due to the extensive geothermal activity in the park. Pressure increases when water becomes very hot beneath the surface. If this pressure exceeds the capacity of the surrounding rock, an explosion occurs. This pressure can create a crater and spread debris over a wide area. Hydrothermal eruptions differ from volcanic eruptions in that they involve only steam and hot water, not magma. Their effects are usually localized, but they can still pose a significant hazard to visitors and surrounding park infrastructure. A hydrothermal eruption occurred near Sapphire Pool in Biscuit Basin. The explosion sent boiling water, steam, and dark-colored rocks and soil into the air. Visitors in the area reported a violent shaking sensation. Many fled for their um, lives as the explosion occurred. Park officials immediately closed Biscuit Basin, including its parking area and sidewalk, to ensure public safety. The explosion damaged part of the sidewalk near the eruption site. Debris scattered the surrounding area, creating a potential hazard to visitors and wildlife. No injuries were reported during the incident. The hydrothermal explosion altered the landscape around Sapphire Pool. It likely created a new crater and reshaped existing thermal features in Biscuit Basin. Changes in underground waterways can affect the behavior of nearby hot springs and geysers. Park geologists are monitoring these features for unusual activity or changes in eruption patterns. The explosion could lead to the formation of new thermal features or the reactivation of dormant ones. These dynamics demonstrate the ever-changing nature of Yellowstone's geothermal landscape. The long-term impact on the region's ecology remains to be seen. This incident served as a reminder of the park's unpredictable and devastating natural forces, the U.S. 
Geological Survey and the Yellowstone Volcano Observatory were immediately mobilized to assess the situation and ensure public safety. Their swift action included data analysis and implementation of protective measures for park visitors.